I'm Sharon from Jimmy Bean School, and I'm here to review the Stephen West West Knits Book 3. You heard me right, Book 3. He already has one and two, which is amazing that he has time to do this, especially because he's learning dance and choreography in Amsterdam, um, where he currently lives. But uh, if you're not familiar with Stephen West, he is the king of geometrical, shaping, elegant, unisex designs. But in, a, in one sentence, that's basically what he does. Um, I, a couple, <laughs> his patterns are just so great. So in particular, this, if you didn't know who Stephen West was, this is Stephen West right here modeling one of his beautiful designs, and that is a cabled wrapped cowl. Um, right here you can actually wear it as a scarf if you wanted to. He shows a couple different pictures for each project that he works on with a little intro to each pattern. So while um, this is a pattern booklet, there is some little snips to read which I think is really interesting. He, uh, right here he has a bag featured, which is just so great. It's a similar design to what's featured on the book on the blanket. It's a felted wool um, bag that when you flap over the top, it looks like half a sun or open. Um, it looks like a full sun bag, but it's felted so you can fit a lot of stuff in there. And it's really, really durable. Um, he, it's called a sun satchel. The, my favorite in particular is the Moose River. Um, it's done in a worsted weight, 600 yards. This cowl just looks so interesting. Um, I don't know if it's the coloring or what's going on, but it is a reversible cowl, dun, 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 which is great, um, especially for the men in your life. They don't usually know when the scarf's inside right or inside out, which is terrible. Everything should be made for men that's reversible. Um, unless they are themselves dinners, then they know all about it, and that's fine. Um, but this has this really, this this pattern right here is really popular, the cabled. In, right here you see what it looks like when it's laid um, open on the inside. Big cowls are all the rage this season and probably into the next season. I don't see these going out of style anytime soon. Um, what he's most popular for, though, is his shawls. In this one, there are a few different shawl designs, but not as many as um, some of his other popular um, his other popular books that we have. So, uh, one of the gals here, Siobhan, is actually knitting this in similar colors. She's using, I believe, Nebula and Candlewick, and it's beautiful. Um, so here you you see what the shawl shape is actually going to be, and right here you can see where. Um, how it wears when you're actually wearing it. So he can wear it a girl corner, you can do it in pink and purple, you can do it in white and black. Um, that's that's another great thing about Stephen West is you might knit something for yourself, but the special person in your life might actually steal it from you. Um, this pattern I love as well. Um, the changing of the, even though there's changing color, it's not it's not difficult. You're not going to do anything crazy in Tarja. Um, the directions on how to do it are simple. If you're new to color knitting, I would suggest um, Stephen West patterns. Um, he does a really great job of explaining how to do those color changes. He also teaches seminars all over the place too. So if you have a chance to run into him, I, I would suggest doing that because he's hilarious. Um, a funny little story, which I have to share, is this, the Seaway hat. So this is done in the uh, Rowan felted tweed. And this man right here is from Iceland. But the funny story is that uh, Stephen West this guy right here is actually an interviewer. So he's a news reporter and um, wanted to interview Stephen West, but Stephen said no until he modeled for the um, the picture for the hat. So he had to wear the hat and then model it for Stephen. And he looks so great and he did such a good job. Um, I hope his interview went really well. Um, but So that's the kind of character that Stephen West is. He's, he's I mean, his fan base is huge. Um, on the back, you can see that he's kind of just a real funny guy. Uh, we love, I mean, a lot of us here love Stephen West. We've knit quite a few of his patterns. I try not to remember how many because I give them away because people just love them. Um, all of his stuff is, is so, so beautiful and guys and girls can wear it. Even though if we, in this book, um, there's only two models, just Stephen, the reporter, and then, uh, um, this gentleman right here, um, girls can wear any of these. It's, it's just that great. There's a huge blanket pattern. The directions are also in here. It's a, it looks like a mandala, but it's um, a circle blanket, which is quite popular. Good for a couch, good for your porch, good for anything really. Um, 
Again, there are 10 patterns in uh, Weston's book three. There's a couple little articles. He goes into um, a little blurb into each pattern and what it's about and what he does. Um, the color's great. The book's really well written. Um, I'm a huge fan of Stephen West, as you can tell. So if you're interested, definitely check out his book three, one, or two, or his single patterns, which he does have quite a few individual patterns. Again, I'm Cheryl from Jimmy Bean's Wool, and thanks for watching. Thunder rumbles on this American summer night